start coming out here more often. All right, Richard here is uh, fleshing out that beaver. Uh, Jamie just cleaned up. So he's gonna flush it out here on the fleshing beam really quick. Snippet there, be roll. Yeah. All right, I want you to get a roll going like that. Or where? Not this way. When I make my simple stitching up this hole, I can cut it at the end and pull it out, and it's all done. It's not like a, a secure stitching like on a shirt. So I'm just going to make a knot like that. And when I'm done, I just pull that out. I cut cut the other knot off, and I go pull it right out. So I'm going to take this. How's that going? <laughs> Run that again. <clears throat> But we're using a heavy-duty sail needle, a leather needle. I'm going to put this off the side. I'm going to stick it in my pants here. So you thought there was no purpose for that needle. <laughs> and the joke's on you, pal. The joke's oh. on me. What I'm going to do now is uh, make some holes, pre-punched holes, through this hide with the tip of my knife. Okay? How far off the edge? Um, only, geez. It's going to shrink up a bit, so you don't want the holes very big. What you want to do is just make sure that you feel contact with the knife tip and the board so you know you're through it, and that's it. Okay. And how far from the edge? How far from how the far edge? From the edge um, quarter under, inch? A, under a quarter of an inch. About an eighth of an inch? Yeah. Uh, no, a little bit more than that. You don't want it to rip through. Okay. And then you're going to do a running stitch all the way around it? Yep, yep. Okay. All I'm doing is slicing this. So you wouldn't do it... It's punching. You can actually feel it punch through. Can you hear that? Yeah. Punch. So you wouldn't do it. <clears throat> Never mind. Don't worry about it. Here, no, I'll put this board up no, no, so you no, can actually no. see what I'm Be doing. Like in a deer hide, you go straight across. You're not going straight across. You're going around it. Yes, because it's a whole. It's a circle. That's the butt right there. I'm assuming. No, these are the leg holes. That's the legs. Leg holes. Cut the butt out of it. You made that V. Yeah, just well, all I'm doing is prepping this so it's just easier and quicker for me to get the needle in it and be done. make it not bigger or anything else what I'm gonna do is if it did pull through like that no big deal Stop a little sooner. I'm no I'm just gonna run it through here and when I want to take it out I just cut that loop <laughs> what I want to do is make sure it's secure that's it <clears throat> you know artificial sinew dental floss something like that it's all good okay and go to the next hole back Picture the candy cone. The candy cone man. <laughs> Fur around the cabin, baby. Candy corn. <laughs> Teaching home act. <laughs> candy corn teaches home act at the driver's class. He's the best at it. <laughs> <laughs> home act. It's oh, looking it like <laughs> I missed a uh, few a spots. Kill. I want to get nice and tight and close. I'm just adding in where I think there's just too big of a gap because I want it nice and tight. I'm just going to fish this line through. How 
How'd that go? <coughs> <coughs> In case you haven't noticed, Richard, we like to have a, we like to mess with each other all the time. <laughs> Just a pathfinder thing. Just the way we are. Familiar with it. <laughs> yeah, he don't sound good. If you come back around, you won't be safe. Oh yeah, man. What? You get one freebie. Right for sure. What am I, Jared Jeter? <laughs> nah, man, you're worse than What did you say about Jared Paul? <laughs> yeah, Jared <laughs> Paul. <laughs> I know I'm sleeping on the ground. Oh, it's good for you. <laughs> good for you, buddy. I did it last weekend. That's good for you. <laughs>